Hey guys, it is That Sweet Simmer, and welcome back to The Sims 3 University Life Part 38. So, in the last part, oh, this is just great. I never remember what happens. Ah, I don't know. But today is spooky day, and we are having a party. I know that for a fact. Is, are there people already here? Are there people already here? I'm confused. <laughs> I think it starts at like four or something. I'm pretty sure. I'm, I'm, I'm actually not 100% sure, but you know. It is what it is. We're gonna change into his costume. Oh, he's gonna do that on his own. I wonder what he's wearing, so I do not know. Okay, what we need. Okay, we have one already, so it's fine. Uh, where are you? She's changing into her costume. I wanna know what she's gonna be. This is gonna be funny. But I'm gonna have her go ahead and serve up some food. Just serve some. Goopy Carbonara, no, I need you to change it to your costume. Do it. Why did that cancel that interaction out? Okay, well, Nate is a burglar. That's really funny. Pfft, okay. And what are you going to be? Stop. <laughs> um, I want to see what Blair is going to be. Oh, Blair is, what is she? Is she a pirate or something? Oh, yeah, it looks like she's a pirate. She's so damn cute. Okay, so she's going to continue cooking her food. And hopefully we can have a lot of the guests just come in here and dance and stuff. So we're going to dance the Smussel dance, which I'm pretty sure that has been a dance since The Sims 1. But I'm not 100% sure. But yeah, so we're just going to have a fun party. Like we're going to, what is this? Teppan, teppan teppanyaki vegetable medley you are attracted to everyone aren't you and then we have some ratatouille yummy we have some leftovers <laughs> all right so blair's just gonna cup her, cook up her grilled cheese which i mean nothing really compared to uh wait that's not carolyn where's carolyn carolyn i want to know where she is is she here? Yeah, it says she's here. I just, like, don't know where. Is Oh, my God. Oh, wait, no, that's not her. <laughs> that would be so funny. I don't know where she is, guys. Where are you? I want to see what she's, like, dressed as. Is she one of these hot dogs? I don't know, because it didn't say she was... That's not her. All right, I am lost. Sydney, Noel, no, that's. I don't know where she is. Well, now it says she's not here. Girl, what? Okay. <sighs> We're gonna continue cooking the goopy carbonara, anyways. She got an opportunity to get pumped or work out until she was pumped to. Oh my god, you are a freak. <laughs> to uh, work out until she gets pumped or whatever to gain athletic skill which we are definitely gonna do because she really likes to work out and stuff so and another person that he is attracted to my goodness you are just so attractive aren't you which he is so I'll admit that but uh oh I don't know if I told you guys or not but I gave everyone a makeover I gave Nate more of an adult hairstyle because he does turn to an adult in two days which is so scary but you know it is what it is and they also gave Blair a new makeover but I mean you can't really see it she has this hair that was actually on my current household sim if you watched my current household um, and then also I gave her a new outfit and stuff so yeah that is that and I guess Carolyn just like left or something I don't really know and Jeffrey is just hitting on everyone it looks like I don't even know he's talking to all the girls but you're gonna stop dancing because you're just like dancing in here by yourself and Ivan is just in here playing video games I really wanted him to go trick-or-treating but like it like wasn't working I don't know maybe we can try again I'm going to go over here and maybe just okay no one's here oh i think they're all at our house um okay i'm just gonna see it just like doesn't let him like when i click on it it just cancels out i don't know maybe it's because we're in a custom world i'm, I'm not 100 percent sure but yeah anyways 
Blair, did she finish cooking? No, she didn't finish cooking. Can you cook, please? <laughs> um, but everyone's just gonna hang out for a little bit. Why don't we have Nate come talk to Jeffrey a little bit? I don't know if they're even friends. Um, and you know, people are invisible. Oh, oh, he doesn't even know Jeffrey. <laughs> oh my goodness. Welcome to my life. <laughs> but um, yeah, he's gonna come talk to people. Where is he actually? He's over here in the bathroom. Oh, he went to the restroom. Where is Serena? Why don't we have Serena go in her room? I'm kind of nervous about her being around all of these people. Not because, like, she's not social or whatnot, but because she's just a little girl. But actually, why don't we have Nate go put Serena in a high chair or in the high chair so that she can eat because she is getting a little bit hungry. And yeah, who's calling? Answer the phone. Oh, it's Carolyn. Oh, wait, don't, don't stop cooking. Don't stop cooking. Oh, my gosh. Please don't stop cooking. <laughs> That's going to be terrible. No, don't. You're going to set the house on fire. Stop. Oh, my God, you're so annoying. Okay, we're just going to ignore it. Sorry, Carolyn. You should have been here. You were supposed to be here. I don't know why you're not, but maybe we should just, like, invite her over see what happens. Um... Because she was here. It said she was at our house, but I'm not really sure what happened. Wait, is it mac and cheese? I said goopy carbonara, didn't I? Okay, whatever. Anyways. <laughs> um, so we're going to go ahead. We're going to invite her over. Hopefully she comes over. And then I think we'll um, call everyone to the meal so that... Oh, oh, dude, it's like 830. Are you serious? Are you serious? People are leaving? Like what? Oh, she has a bottle. Actually, something suddenly came up and I can't make it. Sorry. What the heck? Okay, I guess like whatever. Pfft. Anyways, moving on. Wow, what a party. I'm all partied out though. Bye. Why is everyone leaving? This was the most lame party ever. Everyone's like 80 years old. Like it's not not even nine o'clock yet, and people are like, "Oh, I'm tired. I'm gonna go home." Like, all right, you freaking. Not even gonna say it. No, not even gonna say it. She is so cute as a pirate. I love her. They are so cute. Um, give trick or treat. Oh, <gasps> go go go! Do it, do it, do it. She's gonna go give a trick or treat to somebody. This bitch looks crazy. Like you look crazy. <laughs> I kind of want to, like, get them to take a picture like that. I feel like that'd be super cute, um, if they would. Okay, so she's gonna go give this girl a trick-or-treat. That's so cute. And she's a burglar. It, it's Angel Patridge. Okay. But it looks like everyone is just ugh, party poopers AF, and they're gonna leave. So, I mean... You do you, whatever. I need to get a picture of this though, because this is adorable. Oh. Oh, this is so cute. I gotta get the perfect picture, guys. Sorry, I suck. Okay. So she's gonna do that and then go finish eating what she was gonna eat because she stopped. But we're gonna go eat. The teppanyaki vegetable medley, which is good because she's a vegetarian, so she can eat it. I'm pretty sure. It says vegetables, so I'm assuming she can. <laughs> I don't really know, but after Nate cleans that up, why don't you come talk to this chick? Because she's still here. She's like the last guest here. So when she cleans that up, she's going to go talk to Naomi. And then he'll put away some of the leftovers. Oh, she's out. Damn it! <laughs> Everyone here is such a party pooper. I hate it. Okay, anyways. But then after Blair is done eating, I'm going to have her go ahead and give Serena... Or, you know, we can give Serena a bath and then put her to bed. Because she's super, super tired. And Ivan, what are you doing? Ivan's just over here reading. Um... But he's getting pretty tired, too, and he also has school in the morning, so I'm going to send him off to bed. That was such a lame party. I'm so disappointed. 
Jeez. And everybody says it was awesome, but like it wasn't. <laughs> Blair's party was awesome, verging on epic. Sims all around the town will be talking about this one for years. Like what? We were just standing around my kitchen. Like nobody did anything except for be a pain in the butt and leave an hour after getting here. Like what? Anyways, <laughs> she's going to give Serena a bath and then put her to bed. And yeah, I know. I feel like I've I said this in the last part or so maybe the last two parts this was supposed to be serena's room but i feel like it's just kind of pointless because she we have this like beautifully decorated room down here that i cannot decorate a room like this for the life of me so this is just serena's new room for her being a toddler so she's downstairs and it's like easy to access her and stuff so yeah she's gonna put serena in the crib and then i kind of want i kind of want to get a picture of them to put it up on the wall so i'll probably just do that off camera while like everybody else is sleeping so yeah i'll go ahead and pick up in the morning Alrighty, guys good morning so everyone is awake actually nate is already well he was already at work because he got called in for an emergency so he's on his way home now but he does work again at 9 a.m but blair finally goes back to work today and she has carpool at 7 a.m so we have to get her ready she has to take a shower and all that fun stuff but she's not really fully rested but you know what it's okay anyways <laughs> i want to show you guys the picture that i took so i took this picture let me turn on the light where's the lights uh turn on all lights because i want you guys to see it it's so freaking cute oh my gosh so it's just a picture of them in their little halloween outfits and everyone always asks me how i do this um and basically i just go like this i use NROS master controller I click add sim and then I just add a random sim to the household one that I don't like care about like deleting or whatever so like one of these random NPC sims I add them to the ten or to our household and then they come over here and I give them a 10 uh oh I have the master of the photography skill through NROS of course and then oh my gosh you're so creepy why don't you just like go back to sleep because you're tired go to sleep um but yeah like i was saying i have them get a level 10 photography skill i cheat it and then i have them take a picture of them so it's really simple if you have nros master controller so yeah anyways that's that's how i do it <laughs> so anyways actually why don't you instead of going to bed sorry but go feed her in the high chair i know she's not awake yet but she's pretty hungry and i want her to be fed before they leave so that the babysitter doesn't neglect her, which they always do anyways. <laughs> and Ivan, don't you have school? Oh yeah, he, his carpool comes in like 20 minutes, so we will wait for that. And I'm so excited that Blair is finally back at work. Um, let me see. I guess you can't really like work hard, but you know what, whatever. <laughs> anyways, so he's just going to feed Serena in the high chair and... Get ready for work. Okay, okay. Get the baby food. <laughs> and when do these kids age up? Ivan ages up in four days. Serena ages up in five. Nate ages up tomorrow. So that's going to be in the next part, definitely. And Blair has two more days. So everyone is getting pretty old. Um, let me know down in the comments if you want Blair and Nate to have more kids. Um, I do feel like I want to have them have one more kid, but would you guys, guys rather me not have another kid? I don't know. Comment down below and let me know. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and skip until everyone is home. Alrighty guys, so Blair is off work now and she earned 180 simoleons as well as a promotion. It says, congratulations, Blair's impressive performance has earned her a promotion to sports analyst with a bonus of 360 simoleons. Blair's, Blair Hastings worked hard to promote to a sports analyst. Modern sports is all about statistics, so she can now use a smartphone to analyze statistics, statistics and stay ahead of the game. So she now makes $38 an hour, works from 8 to 2, and works Monday through Friday. So she has the weekend off, which is super exciting. Um, but I, I want to see what this little uh, thing is. Sure. <laughs> um, it says she can now use her smart smartphone to analyze statistics. Where would it be? I don't know. That's strange. I don't know. But I do what I want her to have 
do is go on her blog. Oh, I thought she had a blog. I thought she had a blog called Gossip Girl. Maybe since we're not in... Yeah, see? It's right here. <laughs> what is this? She has 56 followers. So we haven't posted in a very long time. So we're going to post and be like, long time, no talk, pals. <laughs> um, what should we say? I'm a mother now, but still bad as ever wink <laughs> and then we'll be like xoxo gossip girl am i right am i right okay yeah i'm i'm just great so she has gained 14 followers so you go girl and she wants to what is this analyze sports statistics i want to do that too but how <laughs> How do I do it? Social networking? Uh. Where is it though? Am I missing it? I'm definitely not missing it. Where would it be? Mm. Jobs and professions? Yeah, I have no idea. What are you crying about? Calm down. My goodness. Why don't you actually, instead of just putting her in there, pick her up. Okay, my game was like, <laughs> no. <laughs> We're going to pick her up and then I want her to learn to walk. So we're going to teach her to walk. Yay. <laughs> and Ivan is at his friend's house, I guess. Lori Wren's house. Um, maybe future girlfriend. Who knows? And where is he? I can't even see him. Where's his friend? I want to see who it is. Is this her? I saw her like two seconds ago. Yeah, Lori Wren. Maybe they're future lovers. Hmm. Oh, and it looks like Blair or not Carolyn is throwing a party. It is at 9 p.m. and it's casual attire. So, of course, we're going to go. That is like our homegirl. All right, so we were invited to a party. Super exciting. I want to I want him to talk to this Lori girl. She's super cute looking. So maybe when they age up, they could like be lovers. Hmm. I don't know though. I guess we will have to see. So it's taken him so long to like get to the front door of this house or apartment building and the food truck. The food truck is so cute. I love food trucks. All right, so we're here. Where's Lori? Lori? <laughs> Lori? <laughs> Where are we? Is she up here? Yeah, she's up here. So we're going to come talk to her. Uh, friendly introduction. I guess we don't actually know her, but we are at her house. She invited us over. So this is her. She's so cute. <laughs> but we'll definitely talk to her for a little bit before I end this part, which is soon. I don't really know how long this part has been, but you know whatever so he's gonna come talk to her she's wearing her cute little overalls <laughs> oh i can already see it they're cute <laughs> all right we're gonna shock a bra compliment her home uh gossip we're gonna get to know her a little bit see if we can learn some of her traits share a secret um let's see tell a story and then we're gonna try and be a little bit funny make a silly face oh tell a funny story this cat is so cute oh my gosh i want a cat okay you know what guys <laughs> we're getting a cat <laughs> I, I i actually think that i brought it up in the last part that i wanted to get a cat but i forgot what you guys like said or whatever but you know Nate has left work and earned 2,000 simoleons. You are awesome. Nate, like seriously, you're awesome. Ooh, and a promotion. Oh my gosh, so much money. Congratulations, Nate's impressive performance has earned him a promotion to trauma surgeon, as well as a bonus of 2,700 simoleons. Patients who have suffered grievous in injury come to trauma surgeons to save their lives in the emergency room. Seconds count and the entire responsibility for failure rests on your hopefully able shoulders. Thankfully, the entire hospital is here to wipe your brow when needed, just not by everyone at once. 
Nate now makes 305 simoleons an hour and works from 7 p.m. to 3 a.m. So those hours are a little bit crazy because I know he's going to be called in a lot too. I just saw my dad likes to fart. I don't even know. But he is level six of the medical career. So now if Blair does get pregnant, he could tell her gender. So I feel like the next time she gets pregnant, which if we do want to get pregnant again, then we'll have him find out the gender early. So, and then you guys can comment the names and stuff for that gender. So I'm so, I'm excited about this, guys. I'm excited. So he's going to adopt a pet from the shelter. We're just going to look at the cats because I, I really just want a cat. Like, I have a dog in every single other gameplay of The Sims 3. So I'm going to get a cat. I want to get a kitten, though. Because... Yeah, I think I want to get this Elmer cat because he's non-destructive and super cute. <laughs> I just want to look at the dogs, though. I just want to look. They're so cute. This this one's a Samoid? I've never heard of that. <laughs> okay, but I want to get Elmer. Mm. Actually, guys, okay. So... I'll get Elmer in the next part. Let me know what you guys want me to name him. I'm only going to get Elmer. I really want Elmer because he's a kitten and he's just super cute. And I like the fact that he's not destructive. So, yeah. Comment cat names down below for a boy cat. So, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, give it a big fat thumbs up. Check out my social media links down below. Subscribe if you're not already and you'd like to be to see updates and Let's Plays from moi. So, yeah. I love you guys so much and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys. Thank you.